that's the one we're headed for. It did have a name. <laughs> I come up for space, turned around, it vanished. That doesn't make sense. It's that stupid bug. I hate that bug. Anyway. There it is. It's dark. We will be landing on the uh, the uh, big shopping centre first, I think, because that's where the base computer is. So we grab that details. And if any luck, there'll be a, an SRT over to the ship. However, it's dark, so we're going to have to wait anyway. Look at that. Daylight is arisen. There's quite a few ships land here. Well, it's obviously a paradise planet. That's why it's called Paradisium. Uh, the base is actually called uh, Trader Post 5 plus Cruise Liner. Even though it doesn't show up. But there it is. That's what it's called. However, where are we? So the base computer is over here. Just get the coordinates. As you can see, it don't bloody show up. It does that sometimes. It's very annoying. Yeah, that's all we need off of that one. So let's... Oh, wait. Let's, there's a button here. What's this button for? As if I'm not going to be unsurprised. Um, okay. Toggle. Yeah, I figured it might drop bombs. <laughs> there they go. Rolling bombs. Um, I suppose at speed they would be dam bast dam buster, dam buster bombs bouncing away there. So there's the sh actual ship cruise liner. Uh, oh, I try not to spin around. It's so easily done now. So as you can see, I can see his portal over there. And he's built two buildings on that first platform. Okay, let's go over, have a look. Whoa, don't fall off. Right, so he's got a terminus there. It's shrunk, obviously. Obviously. Obviously, isn't it? Now, can we... Oh, okay, I won't, I won't bother catching on the ladder. <laughs> So we, oh, I'm on the bloody, get off. God, when you don't want to be on a ladder, it gets you, I hate those ladders, by the way. It's not his, it's part of the terminus base, the trade center base, ladders. Um, so we've got the wire hider, the power. Uh, it looks like it's, oh, because it's just come up sunrise, isn't it? That's why it's charging up again. Loads of them charging, 20,000 used, that's all right. Millions. G -g millions so we've got solar panels in here uh, that's in this door so oh wait no it's part of the same thing in it there's the hole the original ladder which means the other ladder is out this doorway <laughs> I'm going down I didn't want to get on the ladder I just wanted to look okay we won't worry about it. let's get away from there right so as you can see there it is that's, there's no teleport as far as I can tell. It means I'm going to have to fly over there. So that's the next job. I'm going to climb back up. I'm going to land actually on the cruise liner. And then uh, we'll take it from there. Right, there's a landing spot. We'll grab that one. And uh, a bit of a close up of, close up of a view. Uh, let's see how much space we got to play with here. Oh, well, quite enough. Uh, just enough by the look of it. Wouldn't like a bigger ship. We, it would break it, but never mind. That's okay. So we got a doorway. Should we look on the outside first? All right. You talked me into it. Oh, I hate them bloody double boots, jets, take things. Okay, what are we doing? We got this piece of... Hello. <laughs> There's obviously a galley. Uh, that's a um, shrunken version. <laughs> the actual frostmort doesn't look shrunken, so that grows normally. But it's uh, <laughs> it looks weird. Okay, get up. 
stained glass floor in the roof. To oh God, can't stop swinging around. Mind me, I'm walking across here. Right, okay. Um. Uh, huh. Whoa, that's close. Okay. Why is it doing that? Is it because of it's been glitched in at different shapes? Uh, probably. Look along the end. You never know, there might be a door at the end. We can use that to go back inside. A quick look. Oh, there's a chair. I like chairs. Let's sit down for a second. Ooh, bright sunshine. Um, so there's a cruise lining. <laughs> this may get a bit windy up here. Well, not windy at all if it goes in space. Let's go. Move along. We've been outside. So I think it's the same on the other side. But we go that way. And more chairs. It's kind of like sound deck. Yeah, there's definitely another... <laughs> it looks weird because the actual uh, sole so, um, they're called solar solar vines. I can't want to say solanium. Is normal size and the dome isn't it's crushed they're crushed let's we'll take a look down the back end uh, we are at the back end but we'll just look over the back end Ooh, flames ah, oh, I think I'll go via camera so plenty of engines <laughs> heating the atmosphere up as you can see there's the miniature ones that's the side we came off of you can't actually see me but that's okay so there's no door in that way so i have to go through the flight deck one we're going that side this time though all right that's enough plenty of thrust there you know, there's got to be a door off the flight deck surely that'd be silly otherwise wouldn't it? right here he is we're in we go to the very aft section first Wait, why is there a part of the winged bit? Mm -hmm. Whoa. Okay. A nice small ramp would have done since we're low gravity here. So there's the base computer over there. There's the uh, terminal. I suppose you could jump from here. It's got all these, um, well, one of them anyway. Exocraft machine there. Colossus. Okay, you can watch the ships take off. Let's go the other way. Okay, so there's a diagram <laughs> of a freighter. <laughs> Perhaps it's a different cruise liner. Uh, we've got water going in through. These are, these are showing up everywhere. I have no idea, because I never use anything. And um, <laughs> I, I can't afford to waste bits. <laughs> So, they are, I think they're overlarged, oversized, but it's pretending to pump the water, which is fairly clever, actually. I'll just jump over Oh, I would have jumped over this if I could see where my feet were. At least the bubbles seem to be consistent. Uh, let's go in that one. Okay. Oh, that was coming out of that one. We're going in this one. Oh. oh well. And then it goes up. Stairs for some reason. It's a lot of water for a lot of lavatories. Right, what we got? Oh! Keep spinning, stop spinning. These things still? Another freighter picture. Uh, what's that, a light bulb? I'm asking you because obviously I don't know. Uh, this side, oh, he's crammed his. Oh, wow. That is a lot of buddy batteries in here. And a lot more solar cells. 
Is it the right ones? Let's have a look. No, this is a different set. 238. It's going up. So it's still charging. Okay, so it's kind of like the uh, engine room, I guess. All right, towed in a hole. That's my ship. That's the rear room. My ship, obviously. A tree and a slug in a bucket. An overlarged slug. Don't you come clear me. No, oh, don't jump up and down. Scare the shit out of me if I saw one like that. <laughs> All right, so there's the other flight deck. Now, do we want to go down this way first? Beds. Oh, dark. Turn torch on. Right, not much difference with the torchlight, but you can actually see now. Um, several beds. There's this passenger or crew beds. Wow, there's loads of them. <laughs> it's got to be passenger, isn't it? It wouldn't have this many crew. Mind you. Passengers have to share a dormitory. Yeah, it'd be weird. You just get away for weekend six. Initiate verification. Uh, okay. So there's a wall, which we don't want to know about. The flight of stairs. We'll try them in a minute. Just check the other side of here. Yeah, more beds. It's not the same one because there's definitely a wall in between. I don't know if they're the same. It's a bit smaller this end. This side's a bit smaller. Why's that? Oops. What's in here? Oh. Um. Smoke generator underneath, but that's okay. Plus, it's meant to look like a Turkish bath. <laughs> <laughs> that one's a bit hot, but not that hot. Ooh, purple fire. Oh, I wish they'd change the bloody fires back. That's annoying. Lots of towels. And obviously drinks. You've got to have drinks. Foot lockers, kind of. That's what's on that side. So what was on this side? Just beds. It's an extra bed size. So this... The room's taking up that side because that's got the spa and that one hasn't. It's got, it's got beds. So there's another set of ladders going up there. So we'll try again maybe later if we, unless they come out of the top here as well. Um, we have exocrafts and exocrafts. Uh, I guess you, you got to keep one of those in a base anyway if you want to be able to call it from anywhere. Did I go down there? I don't remember that bit. How did I get down there? Yeah, I don't know. Is there a door? I can't see a door. So, maybe not. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we got um daisies. Lots of daisies. And some brightly coloured rocks. <laughs> Vegetation. This must be the uh, fresh food supply. Although who'd want to eat on that? This is a toothpick. Um Exocrafts, okay. Nothing down there, nice sharp corner. Uh, that says this way to the toilets. Uh, posters everywhere. <laughs> it's a kind of an empty room. Uh, except for this piece. How many is in here then? Five? I see five rocks. Uh, there's one, two. Oh no. But wait, there's a, a, a floating thingy in there. What's they call them? Those frigate things? 
little <laughs> bob up and down a bit and don't do anything. And then we got some, this must be another food supply. Okay, food supplies. Uh, perhaps this is the restaurant area. Ooh, hello, restaurant area. Seatings and a bar with a robot waiter. Robot um, bartender. Or maybe even waiter, I don't know. You could produce the food. Who knows? Uh, expanding gadget. Another little tidy corner. And we got a figurehead. We got a figurehead. Okay. So, where is what? What have I missed? I'm sure I've missed something. I don't bloody miss something. Let me have a quick look down here. Uh, and I don't know about that bit. Oh! In fact, I don't know about that bit. Is that a hole? It looks like a hole. I wonder. Let me just try. Okay, it was a hole. <laughs> I don't think I was supposed to come up that way, but um, it's the easiest bit to find the next piece, wasn't it? So we got. I don't know what that would be. TV screen, uh, a front door. So there's the porch and out to the front. So there's the sh seats again. We've been out the front. Didn't we? Did we go out the front? There's the. Uh, yeah, we did. We went out the front. Just didn't see the door before. It didn't open. So it's got to be switched on. Um, we better say uh, shut the door in case there's a draft. Uh, there's a door shut. I don't want to fall down that hole. I don't know if that's because I hadn't drawn it. Well, that was handy, actually. Oh, God, the light's gone out again. So, it light's on. I oh, know it's not much better. <laughs> not much better for me. So, just like a cruise liner or a ship that goes across a lake, lots of seats. So, is this either a prayer room? Oh, no, it's probably the TV. The TV. I wonder if that floor's actually not drawn in or I can expect a bit. How did you get to that seat? <laughs> okay. So there's a lot of um, seats. They've all got their own earpieces. Go through here. There's the damn stairs. All ah, right, the stairs. That's where the stairs have come up. I could have come up the stairs to get there. That's how you would have done that then. Uh, we've got a teleport here. Oh, did I go through the door? No, I went through a wall. Go there. Let's see where it goes. Ah, uh, a little round room. Oh, wait, wasn't there a round room next to the driving seat? I did see it. <laughs> it's complete with steering wheel. <laughs> Well, I should say. Maybe it's co still called a tiller, is it? I don't know. Would it be still called a tiller? Uh, plenty of maps so they can get lost quite easily. There you go, look out. It's got night time already. Shit, I've been wandering around the shit all day. I'm sure I didn't say shit. I meant ship. Okay, come out of there. So we're back down. Okay, so the first room, there is a teleport which takes you up to the driving seat. Oh, for God's sakes, I keep spinning. My, my controller seems over, overly sensitive. Try this one. Um, we've got... That's glass, I can see the scratches. Okay. Uh, luggage area. Uh, more fried chickens and yeah definitely a luggage space probably made it look like a luggage area which is 
reasonable. Put somewhere, put your clean knickers. Right, get up here. Out. Ah, so that's the first two rooms with the. So these must be. I don't know. State rooms? <laughs> Uh, the passenger, perhaps there's other mile, loads of beds together with the actual crew's beds. And this is the passenger's beds. Probably, he's got more seats than they require then. Or perhaps they stand up. <laughs> oh, hey. So there's like several of these little rooms, but with its beds in it. So I'm assuming that's for the passengers. Yeah, they all just. All the same, that's okay. That's somewhere for the passengers to go. Here's a cruise liner. <laughs> and more beds. So we're looking here, just to make sure we haven't missed anything. So they've got a locker, somewhere to stick their shoes, and waders, in case the ship goes down. Uh, we've got more luggage space. Oh, no, no. It must be a kitchen. This must be the immediate ingredients used yep chickens I hate them bloody ships they're horrible um, so we've got some veg cooking on this fires on these stoves good old happy mushrooms and turnips <laughs> I don't know what they are uh, a couple of bags of salt boxes uh, throwing the goodies away more chickens bags and then over here we got more chickens and boxes serving plates and just in case you've got a peculiar taste geck meat <laughs> I'll have a slice of geck, please, with Tabasco sauce. E. Right, so, now, there you go. I think we must have done. I can't see any other re reason for another room anywhere. Or if I've missed it, then I've bloody missed it somehow. But I can't see it. So, we will call that a day. It's a good ship though, I like this one, it's, it's good to get all the bits you need to go cruising on. Bed proportion to seat proportion is a bit how much, but there you go. See you later.